Hello students, so we are going to solve for the method of least squares for poplar industries or incorporated and the first thing that we need to, to know would be what is the required and the required will be the trouble and entertainment for a week estimated cost so it will be one week no of the trouble cost in the entertainment industry and our x is 200 calls no for the sales personnel so let's take a look at the relevant information what is our um, basis and that would be you have given what are the given item you have 50 weeks okay and we have 6250 calls of the customer and we are given 125 calls per week how do you get 125 that is 6 250 calls divided by 50 weeks right and remember our model here is y is equal to a plus bx or wait in the ito mukhang plus diba yan that would be a plus b x yeah and um, this one will be total cost is equal to fixed cost plus variable cost yeah and what are the other given data we have 500,000 In relation to, to 6,250 calls and we're given 10,000 per week how do you get 10,000 per week that is 500,000 you divide by uh, 50 weeks okay so you have 10,000 per week and so we are tasked to compute for the variable rate b is your variable rate okay so let's compute and how do we compute for the variable rate let's change the color okay the variable rate is equal to May nalimutan ba tayong given? May, wala. Ito na, kailangan na natin to. Uh, call, call deviation, no? Average multiplied by the sales calls de, uh, deviation from its average and the sum. And we have call deviation from the average squared and sum. Diba? So, B is equal to the, the summation of X sub I less x bar multiplied by y a uh, y sub i less y bar okay divided by summation of ito yung ito given lang yan class oh x sub i less yan no uh, square and the data we have 87,000, okay? We divide by 1,450. Oh, come on. You compute. How much? That would be 60. So, that is our variable rate. Now, we can compute for... So, this is your variable rate. 
Okay? Then we can compute for the A or fixed cost. Okay? And mukhang hindi ito fixed, di ba? And uh, so you have A is equal to Y less B X. And that would be how much is our total cost? 10,000, right? Then we compute for B already. It is 60. You multiply it by ilang calls yung kanina? 125. Wait, let me put it para you can uh, 125 calls. And, come on, you determine it. How much? How much? Correct. That would be 2,500. So, that is our fixed cost. So, can we now formulate our cost function? Yes. Our cost function will be y is equal to a plus bx so, total cost is equal to fixed cost plus variable cost. So, you have Y is equal to 2,500, okay, plus $60 multiplied by the number of calls. And we are tasked to determine how much is for 200 calls. So, Let's determine how much is for 200 calls. So, Y is equal to 2,500 plus 60 multiplied by 200 calls. No? How much it is? So, you have... Uh, sorry, nasanay ako sa sign of peso. Diba? We have... 14,500. Okay, so that's the answer. If you have any question, feel free to uh, uh, ask. No? Thank you and good day. We will solve the next problem.